In this tutorial, we're going to take a look at Picnic. Picnic is an online photo editing program. It's free to use. There's actually two versions of Picnic. You can register for a premium account, um, which does cost you a little bit of money, or you can use the free version. And one of the things that I really like about Picnic is the fact that you don't have to sign in, sign up for an account. Um, you can use all of the tools uh, without ever having to sign in. So that makes it good to use with students who don't have an email account and um, wouldn't be able to uh, set up an account. So uh, here is here we are at Picnic, and Picnic is P-I-C-N-I-K dot com, Picnic dot com. You have a couple of different options. If you just want to play around with the tools, they do have some demo photos here that you can play with, or you could upload your own photo. And I'm going to show you how to upload a photo. So I'm going to click the Upload a Photo button, browse your computer, and find the picture that you want to use. And I have a picture here of my niece that we're going to use to edit. All right, so once you upload your picture, you come to the editing tab, and you can see here across the top, you have a variety of things that you can do um, in Picnic. The first uh, thing that you'll come to are basic edits. And the first thing that they suggest to you is to let them decide what's wrong with your picture and auto fix it. So if we click the auto fix button, it's going to automatically fix the picture. Now here we can see that they maybe darken some portions of the picture. Um, there's also some other things that you can do on the basic edits tab. Uh, you can crop the photo, so if you want to take out some of the background, you can do that, and once you click cropped, uh, it will allow you to select the portion of the photo that you want to keep. You can drag on these boxes to um, select the area of the photo that you want to keep. And you can, if you want, like that selection, you can go ahead and click Apply, and that will apply that. Then uh, right here you have your Undo button. So if you don't like what you did, you can go ahead and click Undo, and that will undo the last thing that you did. You can also rotate a picture. So sometimes um, the picture is good, but you maybe want to flip it and have it facing the other direction. That's easy to do here in the rotate area. If we click this, it'll flip it horizontally, and now she's looking the other way. Um, if you decide you don't like that, you can flip it back. You can also flip it vertically, and you can rotate it um, using the rotation tools here. Okay, the exposure tab is next, and if you're not sure what any of these things do, you'll notice you have a question mark button here. If you click on the question mark, it's going to tell you what that um, tool will fix. So the exposure button will fix if it's too dark or if it's too light. You can use these sliders here to um, adjust those things. Or you can actually use the auto exposure button, and it will Picnic will s try and figure out what's wrong with your picture and fix it for you. Colors will allow you to um, remove any unwanted color from your picture. And again, the question mark will tell you specifically what that button does. Sharpen will help um, focus. If your picture is fuzzy, um, it'll help sharpen that. Again, you can, uh, here they don't have an auto sharpen feature, so you would have to play with the sliders um, to get the picture, and you can see what happens when we do that. You can play with the sliders here um, until you get the picture looking the way you want it to. And then you can actually resize the picture. So if the picture is too big, you can go ahead and type in your new dimensions, or you can use percentages. Um, you know, if we want it to be 50% smaller, um, we can go ahead and do that right in here. So that's a, a look at some of the basic edit features that you have. In the next video, uh, next video, we're going to look at some of the other advanced features that you have access to in Picnic.